welcome back all to the main Newcastle career mode. We'll wrap up the season. We've got what 13 games to go. Obviously sitting nicely in seventh or Europa spot, but I wanted to try and push just a little bit more. We're only five points away from a Champions League spot. So we're doing well at the moment. We've had some good results. So we'll build on it and we'll see how the season ends. So first game of the episode, home at Sheffield United here. Obviously I've done my usual trick of clicking too early. So let's see how this game pans out. Newcastle come down this right flank through Mariga. Gets a ball in, put a corner. Ball's worked in by Klassen. And say out, headed over by the defender, another corner. Klassen to take it once again. Whips it in, cleared again to Klassen. Well, big, he's up to one free kick. Newcastle piling the pressure on. Half an hour gone. Martinez whips it in, but it's cleared this time. Sheffield United now in the box. And is that McBurney? It is. Oh, but he's offside. VR just having a quick look. And there it is. Oliver McBurney's goal has been scratched off. Still 0 0. Sheffield United with a free kick. Off in the Castle half. McBurney. And that's it. It's got to be this time. It is. Took a shot from outside the box, turned, and it's 1-0. Newcastle trying to push for this equaliser the last 10 minutes. Corner, Klassen puts it. It's there. Stark with his first goal of the season since joining in January. Heads it home, 1-1. Seconds remaining. Pereira down the left. Cuts inside, and it's there. Klassen. Gets in front of his man, makes it two, and that's got to be three points. Sheffield United just getting time to kick off here. Newcastle clear and referee will he blow? He does. Newcastle leave it late, but eventually win the game 2 1. Newcastle away to Leicester now. Started the episode well with a 2 1 victory over Sheffield United. Let's see if we'll get some more points on the board in this game. Newcastle building an attack early on. Stark to Mariga. Could save Schmeichel. Cleared. Leicester now in the attack here. Barnes down the left. Whips it in. Oh, he's just put it wide. Still 0 0. Newcastle have took a 1 0 lead. Paulinho saved by Schmeichel. But Martinez is there with the rebound. And that's 1 0 just after half time. It's a Leicester corner here. Here was the Perez, whips it in, finds the Leicester man, Benkovic, heads it home, that's 1-1, Newcastle with the corner, oh it's got hit the first man, another corner, Martinez to come over and take this thing, four minutes of injury thing, it's whipped in, it's cleared, Hakimi, what can he do, nothing. Castle just passing it around. Saka plays it in. Oh, it's another corner. Newcastle desperate to get this winner. Pereira doesn't find anybody but gets it back. Unless second clear. Seconds remaining. Probably going to be game over. Can Newcastle get something quick here though? No. And as even as it's Leicester 1, Newcastle 1. So Newcastle home to Arsenal now. I beat them in the last episode. So let's see if we can do the double over them. And that's 1-0 to Arsenal. Martinelli. And Niketa. 1-2 on the edge of the box. And that's Arsenal 1. Newcastle 0. And Newcastle get their equaliser 10 minutes into the second half. Mariga picks up the ball, Klassen plays a Martinez, unmarked, turns and shoots, 1-1. One, one. Castle get a corner, looking for a second now, playing with confidence, and be another corner. Klassen running from one side to the other, whips it in, or oh, Martinez just heads it wide. Newcastle building down this right, always looking for Mariga with his pace. Klassen on the edge of the box, turns. A shock and miss. I think it was Cucurella that got up there. Last couple of minutes now. Newcastle passing it well. 
Paulinho wins a corner. Klassen will come over to take it once again. Got players in the box. Needs a good ball to clear it though by Arsenal. Newcastle still get a class and puts it in. And cleared for the final whistle. A decent point there against Arsenal. Ended 1 1. Man United up next for Newcastle. St Maximin leading the line there against his former employers. Let's see how Newcastle can fare in this game at Old Trafford. Man United come forward early on. Fernandez finds St Maximin, and there it is. Had time and space in the box. Oh, he's actually offside. VAR just confirming it there. But still 0 0. Early scare for Newcastle. And here he come forward now. Fernandez finds him maximum. Good save to Pravka. Newcastle trying to break. Jinsek wins a corner. Money here coming through with St. Maximin, and there it is. He's put this one away. He's had two or three chances, but he's used his pace against his old club. And Man United go in 1 0. Newcastle with a free kick, Paulinho's over it. Has he tried the shot? Well, Henderson's fumbled it. Mariga slots at home. And that's 1 1. Half an hour gone. Man United get their second of the game. And so does ex Newcastle player Saint Maximin. Fernandez sees him in the middle, in between two players. Bangs it, 2-1. Castle looking for a reply before half-time. Done this right as always. Martinez, he's been tripped. It's a penalty. Kulabali gets a yellow card for it. And so does Maguire. Must have been some arguing going on. Mariga looking for a second of the game. He does. Keeper doesn't move. Rooted to the spot. And that's 2-2 just before half time. As you see here, Mariga slots at home, bottom corner. Man United here now, McTominay. He's found St Maximin, and that's his hat trick. And VAR, oh, he's deemed offside once again. Another goal disallowed from St Maximin. Newcastle lucky once again. Man United equalise 3-3, three, three. Entertainment, entertainment game here, Sanchez runs onto the loose ball, knocks it inside, McTominay finds the bottom corner, Newcastle looking to get back in the lead, it's there, Jinsek took a shot, bounced off to the defender, Martinez is there to pick it up, 4-3, two minutes left, Man United trying to build, Sanchez is there, he's fouled on the edge of the box. The cell's in the book. Can Man United get another equaliser here? Sanchez stepping over it, he's took a shot to flex off the wall. That'll be a corner. As Mandy whips it in. Oh, it's put over by the defender, that'll be another corner. Clock's ticking. Mandy again, and another. I was actually saved by Debravka over the ball. Man United, pressure. It's corner after corner. Gomez this time, but it's cleared. Can Newcastle get a break though? Oh, Anderson's come out and claimed it. Man United with a free kick here. Last minute of the game. Fernandez, 25 out. Good save to Prof, guys. Just took the shot. Newcastle just need to clear their lines. Clock's ticking, and there it is. What a victory. Game was back and forward all game. With Newcastle win 4 3. Newcastle on to Leeds now. Leeds holding up the bottom of the table here. So you would think it would be an easy victory for Newcastle once we get the game underway. And Newcastle take the lead. Hakimi picked up the loose ball. Martinez to Klassen. Back to Martinez, drills it in. And the defender. Just bounces off him, finds the net, and that's 1 0. Building down the left now, Paulinho, Jinsek to Klassen. He's been tripped, edge of the box. Cooper getting the yellow card as well. Paulinho steps over, he's took it quickly. He's found the bottom corner, 2 0. Half an hour gone. Castle 
Blackburn from the back. That's a good long ball. Martino's using his pace, smashes it home. Number three. And still 10 minutes to go at half time, and it's not looking good for Leeds here. Newcastle looking for a fourth before half time start, trying to smash one there. And he's turned, he's got it. And again, it's another own goal, in fact. Deflects off Phillips, and that's four now. Second remaining. Leeds just want this final whistle to go. It's been a poor game for them, and that's it. Newcastle run out 4 0 victors against the bottom team, Leeds. Not looking good for them this season. So, way to Evan here. Newcastle take the lead. Cucurella to Saka. Long ball. Martinez with his pace. And again, just smashes it home. 1 0, two minutes gone. Newcastle building down the right. Martinez plays in Jinsek. Smashes it. And that's two. Evan trying to get one back here. Sandro, he's picked it up and got it. Only his third of the season. Evan won Newcastle two. Newcastle are using their flanks well as they get their third. Lascelles picks up the loose ball, plays Mariga, drills it into the box, and Jinsek's there. That's 3 1. Newcastle with the corner, Martinez drills it in. That's dumb it. Oh, he hasn't been on the pitch that long, but it's been disallowed. Fouls his man in the process. A minute left. Newcastle just knocking it about. And they maybe get a fourth. Oh, that's a good save. Pickford. Ball's bouncing. Winter corner. I've got time to take it as the final whistle goes. That's a good 3 1 victory away to Everton. Home against Wolves now. On a good run of form here at the moment. Let's see if we can get the momentum building. Castle on the attack down the left. Akimi finds Jinsek and Jinsek there, makes a 1 0. And. Oh, it's offside. Nine minutes gone. Newcastle thought they took the lead. Newcastle with the free kick. Mariga plays class into Martinez and he's equalised. His 19th of the season, in good form this season. Makes it 1 1. Traore using his pace down the flank. Good ball in. And that's it. It was headed out. Neto on the edge of the box. Volleys at home. That's 2 1. Newcastle trying to get a second equaliser. Mariga using his pace. Stark to Martinez inside. And that's class in. They're looking for an offside. But it goal's given. Wolves aren't happy. When Newcastle equalise, that's 2 2. Second remaining, Newcastle trying to get this late, late winner. Nah, that's it though. Honours even as the game ends 2 2. Tough game next. Up against Chelsea away. Let's see how this game pans out. Newcastle on the attack again. Mariga to Kimi to Mariga again. Plays it in. And there's Jinsek, his 11th of the season, back post header. Newcastle take a shock lead, 1-0. Looking for a second now down this right flank. Mariga's in the box to Hakimi. Martinez slams it home. That's his 20th now of the season. Fine form as Newcastle go 2-0 up. With five minutes to go till the half. Chelsea trying to off the deficit here down the left flank. Odison Adoy takes a shot, good save, put out for a corner. Odison Adoy to take it, get to back, puts it in, but it's cleared out. Newcastle looking for this third now. Classen to Martinez, Martinez is there once again. Finds the far corner, 3 0. Newcastle will throw in deep in the Chelsea half, played in. That's number four, Jinsek. Newcastle have run riot over Chelsea. Shock result so far. Surely not a fifth. Newcastle trying to get one. Saka down the left. Plays the ball in, Jinsek's there. It's bobbled. And Martinez. He's hat-trick. 5-0. Full-time approach in Chelsea with a free kick. 
going to get at least one anyway. They can't. And what an unbelievable victory. As Newcastle beat Chelsea at home 5-0. Confidence will be running high after a 5-0 drum and away to Chelsea. Obviously Newcastle home to Liverpool will be a tough game. Let's see what they can do against the Reds of Merseyside. Newcastle building an attack here from the back. Mariga plays it in Martinez. And this lad is on absolute fire. Smashes that home. Eight minutes gone, 1-0. Liverpool now on the attack. Good ball in. Lacazette plays Marnie. It's bouncing about. And Newcastle eventually clear. Stock to Martinez. Oh, but it's been intercepted. Marnie down the left. Look at the pace. Good save to Provka. Shakiri to take the corner. Whips it in. Oh, no, it's actually a free kick. Done it now to Jinsek. Turns his man. And what a goal outside the box. 2 0. What has happened to this Newcastle team? Liverpool trying to pull through Shakiri. Good ball into Firmino. And he's put it away. Good goal. And that's now 2 1. Clock's ticking down. Newcastle with a throw. Just playing it in the corner. As Mariga gets fouled. The referee's blown up anyway. And another very good victory against a top team. 2 1 Newcastle. This next game will be the toughest game of all. Man City have actually been crowned champions with three games to go. But can Newcastle get some points off them and work their way up the table? Hopefully to a European spot of some kind. Here we go. Man City now coming forward. Sterling using that pace and skill. Aguero, simple. Took it past the Pravka. Slots it home 1 0. Newcastle trying to build on something here. Yeah. Mariga gets in the box. It's a good save by Edison. Corner. Ball's going to come in by Stark. It's headed clear. Stark gets it back from Akimi Saka down the left. And there, the lovely ball in. Jinsek near post. And that's 1 1. Game on. And this is so cruel for Newcastle. Seconds remaining in the second half. Silver, all this time and space. Slots at home, that's 2 1, and probably full time very, very soon. Newcastle kick off, it's cleared, and there's the whistle. Very cruel, and Newcastle who thought they were going to get a vital point. But Manchester City, the champions, go out 2 1 winners. So we're at a forest here, we're line 19th at the moment. I'm not taking anything for granted, but I do fancy three points, so let's get the game underway. Free kick now on the right, Saka to take it, floats it in, Martinez is there, turns his man, bangs it in, 24th of the season, 1-0. Newcastle pushing for a second, class with a free kick right on the edge, smashes it home, over the wall, past the keeper, 2-0. That's all five minutes to go. Saka's down the left. Ball in by Jinsek. Paulinho's turned. Deflected off Yates. Gone for a corner. Stark will take it. Whips it in. And it's there. Haller near post header. Came on for the injured Martinez ten minutes earlier. And that's Newcastle three. Forest nil. There'll be a vital three points as Newcastle push for a European spot. Second remaining, Newcastle just playing it about at the back. To Provka and that's it. Good 3-0 solid win there and three good points. So the second last game of this episode, final game at home here against 17th place Aston Villa. I can probably guarantee there'll be three more points added to the board. Castle with a free kick in their own half. Lascelles plays a well away to Saka. Jinsek and it's stuck in the near post. Keeper should have had that covered, but it's crept in. 1 0. Aston Villa on the hour mark with a corner. Grealish to take in Trezeguet. 
He's put it in. He's got the equaliser, and that's 1-1. One, one. He passes through Saka, Pereira to Hakimi. Plays it into Martinez. Takes around the keeper. 2-1. 10 minutes to go. Oh, it could be offside, though. It's gone to VAR, and it is. It's still 1-1. One, one. Newcastle with a late, late corner. Probably the last kicks of the game. Martinez whips it in. Villa get it away. Oh, Felipe gets the winner. The Brazilian defender, the uncanny of scorers, got to get the winner here. 2 1. Literally seconds left. Just waiting there. We'll go. Villa don't even get time to kick off. Newcastle were hard push, but come out victors. 2 1. So I've come to the final game of the season. I thought I'd show you the table. I've been getting so excited, but I wanted to leave it till as late as possible. As you can see there, we're actually in a Champions League spot, third position at the moment. Obviously, between us, Tottenham and Arsenal, are fighting for them two places. Now, I've got a superior goal difference and are three points clear of Arsenal. So... In all honesty, unless something drastically goes wrong, we will be playing Champions League football next season. So the final game of the season, away to Brighton, we will keep an eye on Tottenham and Arsenal's games as well and see where we'll fare at the end of the season. Newcastle building an attack down the right, Mariga puts it in, Jinsek. I think it just bounced off him to be fair, but it's in the back of the net and that's 1-0 up. Looking good. As all the half teams come in, results are going really well. Arsenal Leicester, who I believe were second and fifth, they're actually drawn with each other at the moment. Tottenham, who were fourth, they're actually losing, so I'll have a look at the table so far. So that puts us into second, Leicester third, Liverpool fourth, they've came from nowhere, dropping Arsenal and Tottenham into Europa League spots. We'll get the second half underway but things are looking good and not what Newcastle needed Brighton have pulled one back from a corner the ball's whipped in and Dunk at the back post puts it away and that's 1-1 one, one. Newcastle now Lamina picks it up Jinsek is running to the loose ball looking for offside oh he is Newcastle thought they'd retaken the lead but it's still 1-1 Eight minutes to go. A second remaining. Newcastle building down the right. Have they got time? Marie Gatt's been put away. And that's it. Newcastle drop two vital points as the game ends. Brighton won. Newcastle won. And the final fixtures have come in. Arsenal have actually beaten Leicester. Leicester did take the lead. They were 2 1 up. But Arsenal run out winners 3 2. And that put us up to second with that vital point. Leicester third and Arsenal taking up the final Champions League spot in fourth. And fifth, sixth and seventh there. Liverpool, Tottenham and Crystal Palace. And going down will be Watford, Leeds and Nottingham Forest. So this is where we'll end this episode. What an amazing season this has been. I didn't think we could ever, well, get into Europe, let alone the Champions League spot and actually run us up. Hopefully next season we can push, can we go that one step further and maybe take the title? I mean, obviously looking at Man City's dominance there, there will be a force to reckon with once again. But I think if we try and keep the core of the team we had with a couple of good additions, there's no reason why we can't push. So if you've liked this episode, obviously give it a thumbs up and a share. If you haven't already, subscribe and I'll see you in the next episode for the start of a new season. Until then, bye for now.